Hello dear students, welcome to Axiomaticos. This video is the part of the solution series for CSIR net December 2018 and we are doing this problem 6 of the section A. It's a problem of general aptitude. Let us have a look. What is the total number of parallelograms in the given figure? So we have a figure and in this figure we have to find out the number of parallelogram. So this problem becomes difficult now. Alright, so this problem is very difficult unless you know the options. So in the option 27 is the biggest number. That means you have to target it. You have to try, you have to try to find out that uh, there are 27 parallelograms in this given figure. Otherwise, you will not be able to find out the total number of parallelogram. You will always miss someone. So what is my target? My target is to find out 27 parallelogram. All right. So now let us begin. So when we will find out parallelogram, we will write it over here. All right. So then we will add So now let us begin So let us begin by just saying this that the first parallelogram that you will have is this All right this parallelogram Now the same parallelogram is here All right this one so you got three parallelogram in this way. The same three parallelogram will lie over here. Three, this, and this. Are you getting my point? So you got three, three plus three, six parallelogram in this way. Now let us change the color of the pen in order to understand it properly. Let us make it yellow. So now see. The same thing can be different. If you will see this way, you will get different parallelogram. Are you getting my point? If you will see this way, you will get different one. Uh, I'm sorry, not this way. For this one, it will be this way. Let me raise it. All right. So two are these and two are these. So you will get two more. So how many parallelogram are there with yellow color? There are four. Now let us again change the color. Let us keep it like this. Now see if you will miss this line, then what will happen? You will get one parallelogram like this. Got it? One like this and other other one. Other one is already counted. You this one is already counted. All right. Now the same thing will lie in the above section also. So you will get this parallelogram. So how many parallelogram are you getting in this way? You're getting two more parallelograms. Now let us change the color. Let us now keep it to be this of color. Now the same thing can be done in the reverse way also. So if you will do this one, this one, you will get a different parallelogram that you have not counted. Are you getting my point or not? So now it becomes a little difficult to identify which one is counted and which one is not. If you will do it yourself, you will get it. All right. So six plus four plus two plus uh, two more. All right. Now see that one parallel. Let me change the color. Uh, let us keep it like this. So one parallelogram is lying here also. One, two. All right. Now the same thing for this one. Three. And then four. So this and this. This. Uh, this and this got it so how many parallelograms are we getting we are getting four more parallelograms all right now let us try to see that there is a parallelogram which which is complete of it this one complete so you will get one more other one is similar to this one like this you will get two more out of this 
Now let us try to change the color. Now see there is a parallelogram over here. This complete parallelogram. From here to here we haven't calculated it yet. Now there is someone here. Alright. So how many you are getting now? You are getting two more. So two more let us add two more to this list. Now let us again change the color. Mm, now let us use this color. Now see there is a parallelogram in between all of these. So two, this two and this two. So how many we are getting now? We are getting three more. So now let us add 6 plus 4, 10, 10 plus 2, 12, 12 plus 2, 14, 14 plus 4, 18, 18 plus 2, 20, 20 plus 2, 22, 22 plus 3, 25. So up till now we have calculated 25 parallelograms. So see in the option, there is no option which is 25. It means that there are more, all right, that, that we have to find out three more parallelograms out of it. Uh, now let us see how we can do that. We forgot, see we forgot to compute this. All right. So what we computed is different. I think we, I, I, I think we have not counted this one. All right, this parallelogram and the parallelogram which is over here. So I think we have not calculated. So if I have calculated, then you you have you too have to think about this that where is where are the two parallelograms more all right you have to think about that part yourself where are the two more parallelograms so i think i haven't calculated so if if i'm making a mistake on this you can do it yourself all right you can always reverse the video in order to see which parallelogram i have calculated which i haven't because i too forgot i think that i haven't calculated these two parallelograms so that was the mistake that i think i made in the beginning so these two parallelograms i think are missing so let us add two now to it so you will get 27 and also see the option we have calculated 25 correctly we don't we know this so that means 3 24 and 14 are incorrect that means we are missing only two all right so these cannot be answered two four and three cannot be your answer so it directly means 27 is your answer so if i am making a mistake on this that i haven't calculated this you have to think it yourself which parallelogram uh, are still there which i haven't calculated all right that you can do yourself so if it is a mistake it's an exercise for you to find out because you have a choice to reverse back this video and see which i have calculated and which i haven't so if you have doubts regarding this problem you can always ask in the comment section if you have any other problem you can join our whatsapp and telegram groups links are given in the description part of the video all right so thank you